Hey, guitar buddies, classic tune there, Don Henley, Boys of Summer. So we start with the slide from C sharp to D sharp because we're in the key of D sharp minor from six to eight on the G string. And then we've got, I'm hammering from six to eight on the D string. That's A sharp, uh, G sharp to A sharp and C sharp back to A sharp. So six, eight, six on G, back to eight on D. And again, then I'm playing F sharp, F natural, C sharp to D sharp. So we've got seven, six on B, six, eight on G. And then I'm moving up the neck to the minor pentatonic shape. Um, so that's, if you want to know the minor pentatonic, it's 11, 14, 11, 13, 11, 13, 11, 13, 11, 14, 11, 14. So D sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp, D sharp, uh, C sharp, D sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp, C sharp. D sharp, F sharp there, uh, but so that's what I'm playing next time. That little lick there, so it's very, very much like the blue scale. So I'm playing 1311 on G, then 11 on G, 1311, 13. The last couple of notes I play, A sharp to G sharp, 15 to 13 of the G string. Now under that, we've got these chords playing, D sharp, B, C sharp, Back to B. Okay, but I wasn't actually playing those chords. Um, that's the harmony. But I was just uh, letting the bass take the root note and just playing over the top of all of those. Um, just keeping this going all the way through. So I'm playing on the B string, seven, six, F sharp to F natural to C sharp. So seven, six to six. Slightly muting that with my palm. Okay, and I just play that over those verse chords. So in the second part of the verse, I added a little muted guitar part which sounds very low in the mix, but I think it's this. So I'm just kind of muting F sharp on nine of the A string. Then playing A sharp, G sharp, back to F sharp. So that's eight, 11, back to nine. So we got nine, eight on D, back to 11, nine. I just also added that in on the verse. On the chorus, we've got three chords. We're starting on F sharp. To C sharp. And you can just add some arpeggios to those, just picking the strings. And there I'm playing a B suspended second because we've got no third, so it's um, B, F sharp, B, C sharp, F sharp. So starting on the A string, we've got two, two, four, four, two, two. And again, you can pick down those notes.
Now, because I played a shortened version, I added in the little solo, little lick that comes in at the end of the song on the chorus in the chorus that I played. Um, so it was... So again, I'm just around the D sharp minor pentatonic. I'm just playing the 15, 13. A sharp, G sharp, back to A sharp, F sharp, C sharp, 11, 11. And again, but without the, the last note, so. Again. And then just doing a classic little. Hammer from 11 to 13, and 11 on the G string. So of course you can use the D-sharp minor pentatonic uh, throughout this song to add some licks if you want to. Okay, and then, so I added that on the chorus and then after the chorus, we go into the little breakdown section. So I was playing. So I'm playing a D-sharp on four on the B string C sharp on two and then D F sharp four four on the G and D strings so and then D sharp C sharp B so going back to the first note four two and then four on the G string so then again back to that first note D sharp to C sharp, four to two. And then four, four, B, F sharp. So, so we've got da, 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 da. So. Okay, so that keeps going throughout the break section. And on that, I added some of the keyboard chords, B. C sharp B B C sharp G sharp and that's a G sharp minor and then B C sharp G sharp and then we're back into basically uh, another version of the intro and on that I had a guitar I put lots of uh, the delay on the first note on the little solo there and just played all the way up the neck a little a little C sharp note all the way up there on 21 let's slide some delay and then just going back to that D sharp minor pentatonic scale okay and you can use that now to sort of improvise add some licks for the rest of the song have some fun with that so it's a great tune and next let's take a look at the bass part for the bass I'm keeping it nice and simple I'm starting with the D sharp on 13 on the D string to a B on 9 to a C sharp on 11 back to a B on 9 and then I just took a little slide down kind of randomly on the same string and then played the same notes but an octave lower D sharp on 6 on the A string B on 2 C sharp on four, B on two. And the chorus, we've got F sharp. I can see you. To C sharp. Stay on C sharp. So four and four on the D and A strings. Down to two, B. Same again. Okay. and then on the record it goes into a repeat of the verse and chorus but I just went straight into the bridge section to speed things up and so on that bridge at the end of the chorus just hang on that B okay and then I added a couple of extra notes in uh, just to fill out the sound the keyboard are playing B C sharp B two four two on the A string and then 
As we go to the G sharp minor chord, or a B, and then took a G sharp up on 13 on the G string. Take it up the neck. And then a little lick you can hear is like one, two. So I'm just pulling off 13, 11, slide down to 10, back to 13. And then to take us back out of the bridge section, I went. So. So I'm just playing that. I'm playing. We've got F sharp to F natural. So that's 11 to 10 on the G string. Then we go all the way down going. 11, 9, 11, 9, 11, 9, back to 11. Okay, so we've got C sharp, B, G sharp, F sharp, D sharp, C sharp, and then that D sharp is taking us back into a kind of repeat of the intro section. All that kind of stuff. So the bass, you can add some little elaborations here and there, but the best thing is just to keep it Really pretty simple and stay on the root notes of the chords. And there you've got Don Henley and Boys of Summer. And thanks for watching, buddies.